We're live here in Hammond, Indiana at Munster Steel, where Hillary made her first stop in the Hoosier state of her primary campaign. She took a tour of the facility when she first got here earlier this afternoon, and then she spoke to a room of about 50 people, many workers and local lawmakers. Her remarks focused on her support of manufacturing jobs, saying she'll make the steel industry's survival her top priority and that she'll go to bat for all the trades. She talked about Carrier and the jobs that it's taking to Mexico, saying companies that ship jobs overseas should have to pay back tax benefits. Clinton also mentioned the recent repeal of the common wage in Indiana, saying that's a violation of Economics 101. I mean, how do we grow the economy if people are not being paid what they deserve to be paid for the jobs they do? We are a 70% consumption economy. And if we don't pay people, we don't grow the economy. That's not good for families. It's not good for businesses. It's not good for Indiana. And it's not good for America. Her remarks here lasted about 15 minutes. After shaking hands on the way out, Clinton left to visit AM General Plant in Mishawaka to speak to employees at that automotive plant. And perhaps not so ironically today, United Steelworkers Local 2003 has members of about 42 companies across Northwest Ohio. They announced an endorsement of Clinton's opponent in the primary, Bernie Sanders. But coming up at 6, hear from the steward of the local here at Munster Steel and why he says he's a Hillary supporter. Live in Hammond, Indiana, Alyssa Ivinson, News Channel 15.